I think over the last six years, special effects has had a, a big uh, revival, if you like. A lot of directors now want to do as much in camera as they can, you know, because at the end of the day, real is real. Um, you know, you've got great directors like Ridley Scott and uh, Steven Spielberg and Chris Nolan that, that are great fans of, of practical effects. And, uh, you know, they'll use it wherever they can initially and then, and then top up with CG effects after that. The scene I'm most proud of is, is, the, is the beach landing at the beginning. Um, it, was, it was one of those... Uh, uh, it was one of those sequences where it's, it was so full on, you know, Stephen wanted, to, as soon as he said action to when he said cut, he wanted bullet hits and explosions going off everywhere. So, you know, and we had, we had like 20 guys on the floor just preparing the set and then they would go off and another 20 would come on to, to, to let the, the explosions off. And then the, the prep crew would then go lead, jump ahead and start prepping the next section. So it was very much a, a conveyor belt system, if you like. We just kept moving along, as, you know, with each scene. The hardest part about that was probably it was just the sheer quantity of of all the effects going off, and and to have you know like ten main actors that were running around in, in this in this supposedly chaos. Um, so we did a lot of a lot of rehearsing, you know, a lot of testing because uh, we had to make sure the crew and the cast were, were safe. With, with each of these people you need to gain their trust as early on as you can and once they know what you can do and what you can achieve then it makes it a lot easier for the rest of the film and you know on Private Ryan the beach landing was the first thing we did you know and Stephen arrived two days before we shot it so I didn't have very much time to convince him that I was the right man for the job and you know lucky enough uh, it, it happened and he, and he liked what he saw. We had one of the actors that wasn't running in the right place and, you know, Stephen wanted to shoot, you know, and we had to call a halt to it. He just said, no, look, calm down, let's, let's get this safe. Um, we took the actor out and because every, every other actor was making the right decision, they were going to the right place and we got the shot. But it was a bit tense, a bit tense at the time, but, uh, you know, there's not many people say no to Stephen. So. And, and he really, you know, he realised that and, uh, you know, he... He always said that the special effects was one of the stars of the movie, you know, saving Private Ryan, and I take that as a you know, huge compliment. Well, it's, it's, it's probably the physical side of it, you know, because like on a war movie, it's, it's, you know, 12 to 14 hours a day, constantly on your feet, constantly, you know, your mind is active for, for the 14 hours, 12 to 14 hours. Um, and if you keep doing that week in and week out, you know, it, it tends that, you know, you get very tired. So it's, it's, it's keeping focus and making sure that you know everyone's safe because you, you know when you're tired you can make different decisions. So it's a it's a it's a matter of keeping focus, keeping your brain rested as much as possible, and uh, getting a safe shoot.